Ooh, I knew how I was supposed to be living like this, man. I always knew. Hey, everyone. Welcome to tonight's Freak Off. Make yourself at home. Here's your complimentary bottle of baby oil on Diddy. If you happen to misplace this one or need any more, souvenir shack set up right out back. Enjoy, Mr. Drewski. Mr. Drewski Combs now. <laughs> man, what is Drewski doing at this party? No, man, don't tell me. We got Shannon Sharp undercover in the freak off. He's wearing the wire. Is Unks, hey, is Unks supposed to be participating in the freak off? Sound like he busting Michelle up. <laughs> Do your thing, then, Mesh, huh? Mess stay focused on taking profit there. I got to fight this thing. On one occasion, it was just me and 50 and about probably six other dudes that didn't want to get out the car because he was ready to get down. And you could see it in him. You can see he got it in him like that. I'm looking at him. 50 ain't back. He don't back down, bro. Bro, we get it. You glazing, 50. All right, it's time. Let's put Puffy away for good. Hey, let me, hey, let me say freeze this time. I always wanted to do that. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, um, for all those that don't know what happens to the white man when he comes to a P. Diddy party, this is what happens to the white man. When they come to one of my parties, this is what happens to him. I put him to sleep. They told me I was an Illuminati too. But yeah, of course you the Illuminati. Of course. You gotta say no to Diddy. If it's new booty in the building, you know he gonna get it. That's why I love Puff so much. Freeze, booty bandit. Whoa, whoa shit. Why the hell is baby all all over the place? So you finally got the dealer, man. Hey, let's go, let's go celebrate. Fifth, I'm gonna take you shopping, dog. What the, what you just say? I'm just playing, bro. I'm just playing. I'm just playing. I'm just playing. So what we do now? Puff ain't getting touched. Don't you understand that? Puff is not going to jail. Everything's on tape. So I'm telling you what, I like you, and I want you. And um, uh, we can do it the easy way out of the hallway. So the choice is yours. Happy birthday to me. Thank you, God! In this prison, booty. Uh, more important than food, booty. A man's butt. <laughs> I'm sorry. It was more booty, having some booty, more important than drinking water, man. I like booty. Let's have a, you know, an act of love. Okay, okay, I came up with honey love. Give me that honey love. Give me that honey love. Listen to my songs for the last 30 years. They're freaky. They're very sexual. Ain't no party like a ditty party. First of all, you know I don't go to those type of parties. Come on, me. I was on top of the world until I met your mother ass, dude. Shit is wrong, dude. I met your mother ass, and all the heat and thunder come around. Throw a dog up on or something. Shit up there talking about you, uh, daddy love. Show us some love. Why was you in attendance that did his freak off? What could the diddler possibly want from you? My like booty you. hole, blood. My booty hole. I'm not giving no booty hole up. When you talk about people that give up sacrifices, bro, the main thing they give up is they booty hole. I ain't giving no booty hole up. And, 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 and I mean booty hole. Man, I'm starting to think he just been pretending to be crazy. We have photos of you and Puffy wearing mansion outfits, and we saw Diddy calling you daddy in his pool. You gonna tell us what we wanna know? What you mean? It's normal to do that. Bring in the witness. Meek says, I wanna hire an investigative team, a hundred K cash, to find out every specific detail involving Meek Mill name to the Diddy case. Hey, what's up, King Son? Man, you doing it, man. You deserve it, daddy. But if you weren't looking exhausted in the pool, look like you may have, you know what I mean? Look like you, you, you were exhausted after slipping and sliding on baby oil. You look like you just went through a marathon, possible freak off. If you weren't looking like this with the compliment you calling you daddy, saying you deserve it, all while you're shirtless and looking so it, it, you look like just worn out yeah i get violated all the time so you like the attend diddy parties on drewski i have been in attendance at, at a puff party you know what I'm saying? i've been in attendance yeah yeah uh, i went yeah but i ain't yeah nah what well, i don't know which party i mean it's a party i wouldn't i wouldn't have one of them parties tell us why ain't no party like a diddy party don't put me in that kind of predicament where we took Puffy down, he gave us a tape, and you're in it. 
I think you better start talking. <laughs> you know, that thing is like in the past and I don't really want to resurface. I'll tell you a couple things. Perfect. What could you possibly be doing with a thousand bottles of baby oil? No, I mean, I mean, I make love a lot. Well, if the world didn't know I love sex, y'all know now. This diabolical. Now since you captured the dealer, you know the Dita gang gonna be looking for you, 50. You probably need to hide out for a minute. Why? Why it feels like I'm the bully out here then? I figured you was gonna say something like that. Hey, what if, what if all this is because Diddy sued them liquor people and the ones in control targeting black power for men like Diddy, Bill Cosby, R. Kelly, Russell Simmons? Nah, nah, they sound crazy. We're gonna need a key witness in this case. I think I have a lead. Orlando Brown set up a meeting with her somewhere secluded. Her name is Jaguar. Jaguar, we here, where you at? You wanted to meet somewhere like this because you fear for your life? What do you have on the Diddy game? The tunnels from Diddy's house led to Hugh Hefner's house. That naked pool was down there long before Diddy was able to buy a home. And how does Hugh Hefner tie into this? It was Hugh Hefner's house where most of the offenses that the women accused Bill Cosby of took place. The Playboy Mansion. Wow, this just get deeper and deeper. No deal. And everybody know Hugh Hefner was filming at cameras in the wall. Did anybody ever ask whether or not Bill Cosby had a freak off tape? Oh, no, Bill, no, he too old to be doing all this. Curtis. There was activity on the dark net Videos were being distributed and were going to be sold for profit because the diddler needs the money. Selling his own God evidence that would put him in jail on the dark net to the highest bidder. The last freak off tape that just got sold on the dark net went for 500 million. It had multiple stars in it. Nicki Minaj, Rihanna, Chris Brown, Justin Bieber, Drake. And now we got a lawyer who has seen it. She saw the very videotapes that I said were about to be sold, but I ain't got no receipts. Okay. You, you know what my receipt is? Reality and time. Yo, Diddy is stupid. What if the entertainment industry is nothing but a cover for a worldwide sex ring? 50, you better end that So you got a bunch of men locked up. In one place, all of them get whore, all of them's horny, all of them got sexual desires. So what are they gonna do? You won't let them have a woman. They gonna have each other. Somebody's gonna have to give us some booty. And it ain't just as simple. He's not wrong. You know, they got this thing where they sag their pants, pants their butt. It's a style, they call it some sort of gangster style. You know, it's sexy to us, right? You sag your pants in her, man, somebody be up in your butt. You know, and it's just that so my while I've never heard that. I'm not no shame in my game. It's just nothing that I'm ashamed to admit. I am what I am. I'm a warrior too, you know, so let that be known. Show some love, brother love. You know, shit. Brother, I'll be seeing you doing your little pretty jazz and all that, man. Show some love. Show me love, what's up, what's up? It's time. So 50, now that the deal is behind you, we can focus on Shreveport. When are we gonna start filming some movies and shit? I'm ready for my part, man. Well, send me to Shreveport, it's the taxing center, right? The taxing center around filming allows me to do things that I wouldn't be able to do in other territory. What? What you mean he escaped? The dealer did it again. F when is this shit gonna end?